Hey guys, it's Gina. Welcome back to my channel. So I did quite a lot of shopping recently, specifically at TJ Maxx, Kohl's, and Ulta. So I wanted to show you guys just everything that I got because what else am I supposed to do on a Tuesday night? So if you were interested in cute fall sweaters and some really nice skincare products, you're definitely going to want to keep on watching. So first, I just want to go through all of the beauty products that I got. Most of them are from Ulta, but there's a couple things from TJ Maxx that I did get. So first, I absolutely need to start with this Philosophy Lavender Perfume that I got from Ulta. Oh my goodness, I've been eyeing this for quite some time now. I literally have been eyeing this one since it literally dropped from Philosophy. Like, I'm following them on Instagram. Um, and when I saw that this dropped, I really, really wanted it, but I held off on it. I don't know why, but I decided to actually try it in store and I literally fell in love with it. It literally just smells like just fresh lavender. It is so calming, but they only have the full size. I wanted to get a travel size, but they didn't have it. Um, so I just got the full size, which is, which is two fluid ounces. Um, so it is quite a big bottle. I don't think it says what the scent notes are on here, but it smells very just like lavender and like citrus notes. It is so calming. It literally just smells like lavender with some citrus notes behind it, which I can get. But oh my goodness, it smells so good. It is so calming. I've worn it so many times already. It lasts literally all day on my skin. I really, really like it. This is probably my favorite perfume I've gotten from Philosophy. It's either that or Ballet Rose. Um, so yeah, it's definitely up there in my favorites. So I got quite the amount of masks <laughs> from Ulta. Most of it I already use already. Um, so I got this like foot mask. I had like two of those. I got a lot of the Tony Moly masks, but I only have one left. I love these. Um, this is just the I'm Rice one. Um, I, I remember I got the green tea one, the red wine one, and there was some other one that I got, but I absolutely adore these. They're so fun. Um, and then I also got a hand mask from Avino. Really, really nice. I did get some of their foot masks as well, and it was really good. Um, but yeah, just some fun masks. Um, I did get this, like, Earth Therapeutics, like, foot spray. My younger sister actually has this. Um, it just makes your feet smell really nice. It's like, just, like, a nice, calming, fresh, uh, tea tree scent. It works. You could spray it on your feet after a long day. <laughs> it's literally just supposed to make your feet smell better. And yeah, I like it. It's just a fun product. So, I did get this Sweet Jasmine and Rose Hemp's Body Mask. This is super nice. It smells super, super sweet. It is so good. Um, I have used it a couple times already. Um, and I do really like it. It makes your skin feel super soft. And this is like the consistency. It's very, very nice. Love it. So next, I did get this travel size Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara. It is the waterproof one. I just needed a little travel size mascara to keep in my purse when my other one runs out. I use like someone from Benefit, um, but I wanted to try this one because I haven't used it in a while. So yeah, I got that. So the next item that I got was actually from TJ Maxx. Um, as you can see by the tag, um, it's the It's a 10 Potion 10 Miracle Instant Repair Leave-In. Um, it smells really good. I really like it. It actually makes my hair feel super soft. I did spray it into my hair last night after I took a shower, and it makes my hair feel super soft. I really, really like it. I don't know how good it is really for your hair, but it makes my hair feel nice, so I'm gonna use it. It says it's supposed to, like, detangle, prevent breakage, add shine, moisturizing, heat protectant, deep frizzes, strength and terrible, blah, 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 all that kind of stuff. So, yeah, it's just a nice product that I just spray in my hair to feel good. So, these next things that I got, um, they actually came together in a box. Um, I got them from TJ Maxx, and it is the iconic Mario Badescu uh, Rose Water Spray for your face. And then it came with this Rose Hips Mask. The consistency is, like, really... I think it's, like, clay. It just smells weird. So... I just haven't used it yet because of the smell. It just smells really, really weird. I mean, it's a clay mask, so it makes sense. It doesn't really smell that what good, but but I do love me the rose water spray. It is so nice. So next, I actually got this from Kohl's. It's just a woman's multivitamin. Um, gotta stay healthy. Um, I also got this from Kohl's. It's just a wet brush because my other one broke, so I needed a new one. It had this cute pattern on it. And then I got this from TJ Maxx. It's just these cute hair clips and I love the rhinestones and the pearls on it. It is so girly and so cute. I just love hair stuff recently. I've just been loving nice cute hair accessories so I just had to grab those. Uh, next I got this BB cream. I'm actually wearing it right now. Um, I've actually never used it before. Um, I bought it from Ulta. It has SPF 30 in it. 
I know this is like a holy grail for some people and I just wanted something like light when I wanted to do like natural makeup like for example today so yeah it's just in the light slash medium sheer tint I do like the product so far so instead of putting on like a ton of foundation I just put on this when I want to wear natural makeup um so yeah oh my goodness I've been loving this I already used it like three times already um it is the Mario Badescu seaweed night mask I absolutely love it let me show you guys the consistency so you literally like just put it on your face and leave it on overnight um you don't need to wash it off or anything like that it has a nice like marine smell to it i really really like it it makes my skin feel so soft in the morning see i've definitely been enjoying that so next i got this fresh rose deep hydration face cream um i did use it once the smell like kind of it's like really like sweet I don't know it just like has this really like distinct sweet smell i can't really like describe it i do like how it made my skin feel though i put it on like a random morning when i was getting ready for work and i did like how it made my skin feel so it definitely does work but i've been liking some of the lancome products better i bought this what is it hydrazen so i bought this hydrazen anti-stress moisturizing cream gel Oh my goodness, I got it both in the big size and the small size. Um, Originally, I got it in the mini um, and I liked it so much that I actually bought the big one. This is the packaging, so nice. Um, But I absolutely love it. Everything's like nice and rose. I just absolutely love the packaging. It is so cute. And I just really like the smell. It's like a rose kind of smell. I really like it. I think it's fragrance, but like literally I don't care. It makes my skin feel so soft and I love the consistency. This is the mini one. Um, a lot of people left good reviews that have made the like pore small and everything like that. So like I just needed to try it. It is so good. I am literally in love with it right now. So that kind of overshadowed the fresh one. But I did get some more stuff from Lancome. Um, I actually have not tried this mask yet. Um, it is the Rose Sorbet uh, Cryo Mask, I think that's what it's called. Um, this is the consistency. Um, it is one you have to like wash off, so that's why I haven't used it yet because I'm lazy. So maybe I'll use it within like the next couple of days or something like that. I'm really excited and it does smell like a rose. But, oh my goodness, I decided to try a toner. I've never used a toner before. Um, I know that it's like a little unnecessary for like cleaning your face. Um, but I wanted to try it, like, if I'm wearing makeup that day, I need to take it off, I need to use a toner to get it, make sure it's all out of my pores and stuff like that. Um, so I did buy a toner. I love the packaging, it is so cool. It is really, really pretty. But this is what it looks like. Um, I think it's meant for dry skin, um, so it is very, very moisturizing. I don't know if this helps, but, like, there is a nice consistency to it. It is very, very moisturizing. Um, after you use it and it smells good too it's just nice and fresh like a rose it's so good i did use it once after i put on makeup and it did get a lot out of my pores like i literally just took it put on a cotton pad wiped my face and boom there was still stuff after using like my face wash and stuff like that um so i do know that it works so i am very impressed by it um this last thing that i got from ulta it's just this cute little self-care headband. Um, I had one, but I gave it to my sister, so I needed a new one. Um, so this is what it is. It's just this cute hot pink color. I absolutely love how soft it is, and I really like the bow. Okay, so next I'm going to go into all of the real clothes that I got. I'm going to split it up between uh, Kohl's and TJ Maxx. So I have to start with this cardigan because I've been wearing it. I'm already going to tell y'all, I have been wearing it for days, and I am so pleased with it. Um, it is this Joey, as you can see the brand, it is this Joey cardigan and it is so long, it literally goes down to like, like past my kneecaps. It is a very, very long cardigan. It is the softest material I have ever felt in my entire life. It literally feels like a blanket. I could not recommend a better cardigan if you just want something warm to like hug your body. It is literally the softest thing on the planet. Like it literally feels like a blanket. It is not itchy whatsoever. It is the best cardigan I've ever had. Sometimes like I try to stay away from like sweaters. Like this one I'm wearing right now, it's like a little itchy. Like sometimes it itches my neck and stuff like that. Um, it is cashmere, but oh 
my god this cardigan literally feels like a blanket like i literally wore it to bed <laughs> like it is the best cardigan ever so yeah could not recommend this one more i got it from tj maxx and because i liked it so much i actually went back and got the other color that i saw um i didn't want to get both at first but when i realized how much i was using the gray one i had to get it in another color because girl it has to match my outfit with whatever i wear it with so obviously it is the same brand um, I got it for $39.99, so I think the other one was the same price, too. It is the same size, I think, as the other one, too. I think they were both mediums. But it's just this, like, peach, pinkish brown color. It is just a nice, neutral shade. I love the grain, how it's, like, white and the actual, like, color, like, the nude color. It is just so soft. It is literally like a blanket. And I don't usually wear like cardigans especially long ones like once i go like all the way down to my calves but it is just so soft it feels like i'm wearing a blanket and yeah i'm just obsessed with those so next i got this philosophy sweater from tj maxx it is just in the color gray and it has a v-neck trying to show you guys this is the v-neck there you go and then obviously from philosophy um i got it for $19.99 but yeah it's just a nice casual sweater perfect for the office or for going out on a casual day it'll pair very well with like black leggings or something like that so yeah got that just the fall basic so next i got these two i think it's cyrus sweaters they're the same exact design just different colors so this first one it's like this grayish brownish kind of color um a nice neutral shade i feel like this is just a basic fall color <laughs> like i don't know i feel like it could go well with anything it has this cute design on it i love like the stitching that's on it like this part it's very very soft and i did pick it up for 24.99 at tj maxx but yeah just a really nice sweater i think the shoulders are just very loose um so yeah, it's just a, a really nice casual sweater and then obviously same with this one it's just an a orange shade perfect for fall so cute so soft too and yeah, this one was also 24.99 and this was the brand Cyrus. So yeah, next, oh my goodness. Usually I would never wear anything like this, but it is the softest sweater thing I've ever found in my entire life. And this is what it looks like. It has this blue and white plaid pattern and it has a V-neck, if you could see. And it is literally like just the nicest, softest sweater ever. Like, oh my goodness. I am like literally obsessed with it. I could probably sleep in this. It is that soft. And it is quite thick. So this will keep me warm. Yeah, I've just never worn anything like this before. Like I don't usually wear plaid. I was like shocked in myself for buying this. I was like, do I really want this? But it is so soft. And it's, I mean, I could probably wear it with like jeans or black leggings or something like that. So it's just a nice sweater. And then the brand is Christian Serrano. Um, so yeah, and I paid $20 for this. It had the markdown tag. So yes, yeah, super cute. Um, next I just got this basic t-shirt. Um, it is just in a nude color. Literally could wear it whenever. And I bought it for $12.99 from TJ Maxx. Um, it is from the brand Truth. So yeah, just a basic t-shirt. It's quite thick though. Like, I don't think it's going to be like that sheer. It's really nice. And the next, I got these two other shirts from the same brand um i think it's called tahari or something yeah this is the brand tahari so i got it in the color black and it does have a v-neck it is just a loose fitted um soft to the touch kind of shirt just a nice fall basic and then i got the same exact shirt but with a different neckline it has a scoop neckline um and obviously in the color white very just a nice loose fitted shirt so that was it for all of the tj maxx stuff Next, I'm going to go into the Kohl's clothes that I got. So, for some reason, I've always liked Lauren Conrad's clothes. At least some of it. <laughs> um, so, I want to start off with that first. Um, I need to start out with the sweater because I just thought it was just the most girly, gorgeous sweater I've ever seen. And it looks like this. I absolutely love it. I love just all of the different colors in the sweater. It is so intricate. It reminds me of like a birthday party or something like that. Um, it does have like that shiny stuff in it. So it does shine. So it's mainly this like pinkish purple kind of color. But as you saw, there's a lot of different colors in the actual sweater. It has just nice knitted patterns all over it. And it kind of has 
this thing going on in the chest. I wish it was a little bit softer. I can see myself thinking it's going to be probably a little itchy when I wear it. Um, not like unbearable, but just like, like the one I'm wearing now, it's just like a little itchy sometimes. Um, but you wear it because it's cute and it keeps you warm. <laughs> yeah, it's just a fun sweater that I got from Kohl's. Um, that's from the brand Lauren Conrad, as you can see. It did retail for quite a lot, but there was a sale going on. Um, same thing with, like, the TJ Maxx stuff. Like, I, I did get, like, some other discount. See, I got discounts with a lot of stuff that I got, even from the Ulta stuff. Like, I had points uh, for TJ Maxx. I had some, like, whatever discount thing. And then for Kohl's, I had Kohl's cash. And there was also a sale going on. So there's lots of deals going on. So I did not pay full retail price for a lot of things in this haul. And the sweater was one of them. Um, next, I actually got the same sweater from Lauren and Conrad, just in a different color. Because I really, really liked it. I just love the shininess of it. It is so cute. Um, I feel like I could wear it with like black leggings and boots. See, it's just this nice dark blue kind of color. It's just so cute. I love the little shine to it. I just really like the shine in it. If it didn't have the shine, I probably wouldn't have gotten it, but it does, so I got it. But yeah, it's just a gorgeous blue color. So cute. And then obviously from Lauren Conrad. So I did get some leggings from Lauren Conrad as well. I noticed that their leggings were very thick and will probably not be see-through, which is an issue I have with lots of cotton leggings. So first I got this gray pair. Uh, I feel like the waistband is kind of like stiff, but it is stretchy. Um, the legging itself does feel really soft. And it does not, hopefully, <laughs> hopefully, I don't think it's going to be see-through at all. Like it's really, really nice quality. So... Lauren Conrad. I got on a size small, which is my normal size. So yeah. Um, I got literally the exact same uh, legging, just in the color black. So yeah. But I also did get another pair of black leggings just from the brand Sonoma. They're sort of like, I feel like they're like the main everyday kind of brand that Kohl's is like primarily selling. Like their stuff, their stuff was like everywhere in the store. So yeah, just cute black leggings because I really need some. And the rest of what I got is just a bunch of Sonoma, like, basic shirts. So, first I got this waffle knit shirt in the color, like, cream. Really cute. Has, like, a scoop neck. Um, I really liked the ruffles at the end of the shirt and on the sleeves as well. Thought that was really cute. But yeah, just a basic shirt. And then I got the same thing, but in this, like, pinkish coral kind of color. Um, I liked how sort of like the stitching was like a little bit orangish. Um, I thought it was just really cute. I love the ruffles, of course. So cute. And then lastly, I just got these Sonoma basic shirts that have like a v-neck. So this is just the one in black. And then I got the same one, but in white. And then lastly, in the color brown. So yeah, so that is it for today's haul video, guys. Oh my goodness, I went through so much stuff. So yeah, that was just my fall shopping of the year. I feel like I will never need to buy clothes ever again. But so yeah, let me know in the comments if you guys have done your fall shopping yet. As slowly the weather turns cold. Let me know in the comments what you think of, I don't know, TJ Maxx recently. I feel like there's just like a lot of people shopping there. There was a ton of people in TJ Maxx when I shopped there. Let me know what some of your beauty favorites are that I got from this haul. Let me know your thoughts. But so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this haul video. And of course, I hope to see every single one of you in the next one. Bye guys. Thank you.